Welcome back to Howdy Philippines. Our next guests are from Worship on Wheels. They travel around the U.S. with a mission to help out those less fortunate in the Philippines. Welcome to Howdy Philippines. Howdy. Mr. Howdy. Troy Beaver and Thai Beaver. Uh, Hi, Miss Thai and Miss, uh, Mr. Troy. Hi, welcome. You know what? We're just so curious and knowing yourself. We want to know what exactly you do. Are you Who are the beavers? The beavers. <laughs> We're busy, busy beavers. <laughs> the busy beavers. Yeah, okay. busy beavers. Um, Thai. My name is Thai, and I'm from the Philippines. And um, and we have three kids. One mm -hmm. is in college, and then one is still in elementary, and one is kindergarten. I was a teacher, and he was a firefighter. He can tell you about that later. Oh my God! Yeah. How about you, Troy? Yes, I am. I'm a retired Houston firefighter, oh. and I, we fell in love with the Philippines, or I did. <laughs> fell in love with the Philippines, and I knew that I had to go back and serve when I left the department. Oh, amazing. I oh left. Yes, I You're... left, and, and I really miss it, but I've moved on to something bigger. Where did you go to the Philippines? Uh, Ty took me to the Philippines. Who oh, right. wow. <laughs> wow. You fell in love with the Philippines. Tell us something about your family. We are. Just a normal family, just like anybody else. We have uh, our children are bilingual, and uh, right. they love the Philippines and the U.S. both. Why bilingual? That's really nice. Wow. At least they can speak Tagalog. They do. Wow. Yeah. How about you? Conti lang. Wow, conti lang. <laughs> so, how are the beavers called to do? The, you know, to the mission field. Well, it's it's kind of a long, some somewhat tragic story. We we're in a car accident in 2009, uh -huh. and uh, due to cervical spinal injuries and fractured skulls, uh -huh. things like that, it led me to an early retirement. Oh, and uh, I'm sorry to hear that. That's okay. Right. It's it was all in God's plan, and God moved us to the Philippines to serve the children there. In the Philippines. So, what does wheels? I mean. Worship wow. on wheels doing the Philippines or, and wow, why did you right. choose the Philippines? Wow. <laughs> we naturally have a connection with, yeah. with Ty. She naturally was that connection to go back. A lot of what we do is vacation Bible school programs that are translated from English into Tagalog. 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 Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we do that on different islands, different tribal villages, different impoverished squatters right. areas. Where in the Philippines like we're different, yeah. Uh, well, we've been to Palawan, we've been to Mindoro, uh, we've been to Tarlac, Tarlac, and even the mountain area in Nueva Vizcaya and uh, Mindoro. I said Mindoro, right? And Wherever some, we're called. Yeah. Whoever needs us, we go. Yeah, if we they go need to Cebu too, that's my place. I actually, yeah, we would like to go to Cebu one time. Oh. I mean, we've been there, but not on a mission yet. But you have to. <laughs> How We've long been to I'm yeah, sorry. It's okay. Sacloban. How long has Wow been in the Philippines? We have been there in 2012. Yeah. Is when we moved there. 2012. Oh. The summer of 2012. It's about four years. And you've been to Tacloban, years, yeah. you said, right? Yes. When the typhoon hit Tacloban, he was one of the responders just to. Great job, guys. Yeah. Take some of the food that he's going to share. <laughs> <laughs> Our goals are continue just to feed and reach out to the children who are who are impoverished and, and have not who have not felt the love of Christ and the love that He offers to everybody. Yeah. One of the blessings that we actually received was uh, we got introduced to a organization called Convoy of Hope, where they were the ones that give us free food like this. And Troy can. What is that? This is enriched rice mix. Yeah. And we get thousands of pounds of this every year mm. through Convoy of Hope Philippines. It's an organization based in the U.S., but warehouses in the Philippines. Mm. And so we are given hundreds of thousands of meals every year to give to the children mm. so in impoverished areas. Yeah. It's rice? It's yes, rice it's mix rice. with. Mana, but you're... Wow. So is this for children? Mm -hmm. uh, even for adults. Pack with love by volunteers. Aww. Fortified so, rice, rice and soy protein. We this make really show it to people. Very nice. We make lugao. Mm -hmm. Lugao? Yeah. From with this? That, yes. Wow, I love lugao. Can I be part of those children <laughs> <laughs> lining up for lugao? <laughs> yeah. It's very um, nice. Yeah, and sometimes we make 
uh, lumpia out of this brown stuff. So we have separation party. We separate the rice and the brown. Oh, really? Yeah. Troy, what is the best part about living in the Philippines? The best part just is being with the children and seeing the eyes light up and the smiles on the faces oh. when, when I dress up like Captain America and come to their village. And... Oh, I like that. <laughs> He's very tall. He's like a, like I a know. superhero. He can be a superhero, yeah. <laughs> I'm actually the runt of my family. I'm the shortest one. Oh, really? But in, uh, the, in the Philippines, I'm pretty tall. Uh, yes, you yes. are. What are those shoes? These shoes are also by Convoy of Hope through Tom's Shoes. Tom. We've gotten thousands of pairs of, of Tom's shoes to give away to children who don't have shoes. Oh. It comes in different sizes, right? Yes. Yeah. Anywhere from these to size 14. Wow. Which are not very popular in the Philippines. Wow. Wow. <laughs> so if you, when you buy Tom's shoes here, uh -huh. You send a pair somewhere else. And I like that. So nice. yeah. I buy Tom's already because yeah. I want to help. We will be helping people. Yeah. yeah. And at first we didn't know that they do that, but when we got to the Philippines, we realized that oh, we are and the receiving end. Children in the Philippines, I heard in one news before, like they go to school without shoes. Without, without shoes. shoes. Right. Yeah. Not even yep. slippers. They have slippers, oh. but it's like it has holes. Yes. Right. Yes. That's the reason why this was the first edition. And then mm -hmm. they changed it to this. So, you know, when rainy season comes, it's, durable. it's, yeah, it's yeah. more useful. So where do you usually go when you conduct missions? So Tacloban, yeah. and you mentioned other places. Palawan, Palawan for a medical mission, and then Tarlac, Vizcaya, that's the two places that I always go to, and Mindoro. So Tr provinces, not yes, Metro provinces. Manila. You're not yeah. just we, giving food, but you have some, the medical We do too. some Metro Manila, but Metro Manila is served by lots of other missionaries. Right. There's a lot, yes, right. correct. Yes. So what, what we do is we try and team up with churches in provincial areas and mm. tribal areas that need oh. that need some help. Because mm -hmm. we have a big truck, that's why it's called Worship on Wheels. Because and we take that truck to impoverished areas. And so Troy is the one that wheels. drives. So this truck is in the Philippines right yes, now, yes, right? Yes, yes. Oh. I am a full-time driver. Oh, so you're the driver! <laughs> that is what I do time. in the Philippines. Yeah. Oh. So when people complain about Houston traffic, it's nothing compared to, right. compared to the Philippines. <laughs> yes. Traffic so is speaking of traffic, what um, challenges have you encountered? Yeah, I mean, you've got a lot in, probably. The in the Philippines when you do your mission. Traffic is what? Traffic is a huge problem, which uh -huh. is why we go to provincial areas. When we go somewhere, we we leave at midnight and we come early in the morning. Yeah. We don't travel during the day. Yeah. Uh, some of the other obstacles are just mm -hmm. language. everyday yeah, language miscommunication. Mm -hmm. Miscommunication. <laughs> miscommunication. So probably they don't understand you while talking. That's right. why you need to speak Tagalog. I need to. <laughs> I translate all the time. Okay, Can you give us a sample of your Tagalog? Can you greet our friends? Wow! Okay, what <laughs> else do you know? Mabuti. Mm, I know malaki. I know. Maganda. I know mataba. Maganda. <laughs> Maganda. <laughs> Maganda. <laughs> Guapo. Wow! <laughs> Pogi. 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 Yeah. 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 That's nice. Very good. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> It's, it feels amazing you talking Tagalog. Thank you, thank you so much, and thank you for teaching him. And you know what? I, I'm one of the people who wants to, to donate or to like to be part of really it. Really want to help. So if uh, people want to contact you to either donate or interested in volunteering, how can they get in touch with you guys? Well, you can do anything from give. Uh, Philbolic buy-in boxes. You can even come over and stay with us and visit with us. Yeah. Just go to www worshiponwheels.com our website will give you everything you want to know about us and mm -hmm. you can contact us through our email and uh, we'll be staying in the states until the end of june and then we'll head back to the philippines and i'm sure many of our kababayans would like to help so how can people help you in your mission work how can they join can they volunteer if yeah. ever yeah they can they can volunteer or they can just contact us and we will give them so no matter what they do, no matter what their specialty, we will find a way for them to be involved with yeah. us. Okay, just like um, log on to the website. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, do it again. Can you invite our Kababayans? Phone please? number. Phone number, website. Can you please tell our Kababayans how to yes. contact you, please? Uh -oh. <laughs> www.worshiponwheels.com
All right. Yes. Thank you so much, right. Thank you Mr. So much. Troy yes. Beaver and, and Miss Ty Beaver. Beaver. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you. Honorable yeah. Hawaiians, the Beavers. Very good. Thank, Thank you. you. I love Thank that you. mission. You know, it's such a great advocacy. Wow. Thank you for all that you do. Mabuhay, Mabuhay. to all of you. And, um, you know, Worship on Wheels, I love you. And I hope people will love it and try to donate and start Let's help Kababayans. Let's help our Kababayans. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you so much to both of you. Kababayans, please remember, we are here to support you. Let us help you reach out to our hundreds of thousands of viewers and fans across the world. Let us know if you have an event, fundraiser, gathering, or something going on. Please let us know and we'll include it in our community roundup. With the Philstream box, we can now be seen all over US, Canada, UK, Australia, and Dubai. Also, Kababayans, if you have an interesting story or know someone you think is interesting to be featured, please contact us at PinoyUsonTV.com or any of our social media sites. We also have internship opportunities available especially for contributors, segment producers, and marketing associates. After Howdy Philippines, don't forget to catch History with Lord Chismis Noon, History Ngayon, or Gossip Before and History Now. And Kaya! And thank you, Mr. Roderick Alfred of Amazing Fashions. Check out his shop located at 19333 Highway 59 North, Humble, Texas, for all your fashion needs from men's wear to chic ladies' wear. And thank you also to Dr. Christine Chang of Nuvo Medical Aesthetics. How do you take care of your skin? How do you, do you need a little help? Come on, buy it. Fan for yourself and your loved ones by having a youthful skin. Show off your face and body for more youthful appearance. Visit Dr. Chang's clinic located at 546 Will Drive, Houston, Texas, 77019. The best skin doctor in town, yes. guaranteed. Thank you so much. Thank you also to Tutu Cute by Jacqueline Smoke. Thank you. Um, you know, you can log into her website or like her page on Facebook. Just like that. That's right. So it's a cute by Jacqueline Smoke. And of course, my Kabayan, please don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and log on to our website, mm -hmm. PinoyUstunTV.com. And subscribe to our YouTube channel. Yes. Please join us again same time next week as we keep bringing people together. Texas, America, join us in saying, Happy Philippines! See you all next week. week.